Today I'm going to show you how to use my image bracelet maker to create your very own personalized bracelet. To begin, open the left drawer, take out your glue and put it in the holder on the top left side. Next, take out the pre-printed image cards and two elastic strings. Next, open the right drawer and pick out your favorite colors. I'm going to use turquoise, pink, and yellow. Next, take your tiles and line them up in front of your image bracelet maker. To determine the size of your bracelet, take a piece of elastic and wrap it loosely around your wrist. Find where the open end meets the string and hold this spot. Use this length to measure the tiles and determine the size of your bracelet. My bracelet will be about seven tiles long. Once you know the size of your bracelet, you can start lining up the tiles on my image bracelet maker. Make sure the thread holes are parallel to the sides of the tile holder. Slide the tiles to one side and then take a piece of elastic. Insert the elastic string into the first tile and keep pushing it through until you see it come out the other end. Pull the string until it looks about even on both sides. Repeat this step with the second piece of elastic string on the bottom thread hole. Now you're ready to choose your images. You can pick from the pre-printed image cards that come with your image bracelet maker, or you can go to www.myfbm.com to create your own personalized image cards. Start by picking an image card you want, and then insert it into the slot. When you see the photo you like, press the yellow handle down firmly, and take your photo. Repeat this process until you have enough photos for each tile. Next, take your glue stick and apply glue to the back side of each image, gluing one image to each tile. To create the second side of your image bracelet, take the strings at each side, pick up the bracelet, flip it over, and place it back into the tile holder. Now you can cut out even more images to make your bracelet. After your images are glued, take the ends of your string and bring them together. First, use the two top strings and tie a simple double knot. Remember to pull it tight so your bracelet doesn't come apart. Repeat this step with the two bottom strings. You can use a pair of scissors to cut off your extra string. Find the knot on the string and go to the opposite side of that tile and insert the knot key tool. Twist the key towards the center of the tile while holding the key down at the top of the tile. As soon as the knot is pulled into the tile, release and remove the key. Repeat this step on the second string, remembering to twist the key the opposite way. Okay. Now you're ready to wear and share your one-of-a-kind image bracelet.